So I'm often asked, how do we communicate effectively with our senior level management team? And four things come to mind. First of all, put the uh, information in the kind of context that makes sense. What are the big things that we really care about? Maybe it's not so much, here's how long and these interactions uh, lasted on, on average, or how many we handled, or, or, or those sorts of operational issues. It's how well are we serving our customers? What, what's the trend on customer satisfaction? What's the trend on our cost structure? Um, where are things going? Uh, what, what is our market share, our brand reputation look like? Second, we keep it quick. Uh, senior managers, we just, none of us, we, we don't have time in today's environment to digest uh, loads and loads of detail. It should be there for support, uh, but, but get the point across. Uh, thirdly, put it in context. Here's what happened and here's what it means to us. Um, our, our customer satisfaction scores, 91% sounds terrific. What if we flip that upside down? We've got 9% who for what, whatever reason aren't giving us top marks. Why? Why? What's the what's the reason behind the why? What's the context? What's the the the, the larger organizational uh, consideration around what we can do to really make an improvement? And finally, where where do we think we can go to really differentiate? What is what does this really mean in terms of innovation and in terms of, of moving things forward so that we are uh, not only competitive, but in our customer's mind, and this is true whether we're a nonprofit or government or a, a commercial uh, for-profit organization, do they feel like we get it? We're out there, we're, we're, we're leading with our services and that we can compare to anybody out there. So those are the four things that we recommend and with that, uh, we're, we're going to have the kind of cross-functional and top-down support that we need.